We are mindful that with regards to VIP things, frequently don't exactly match the public picture anyway. Apparently, the Harvey family has taken this thought to an altogether new level as ongoing news has uncovered that their public persona is just a veneer. No, I haven't seen her. Except for she looked great on her photos, Shirley Strawberry was on a call with her significant other in this discussion. And there were several different remarks that she made in all honesty. I love mine according to a cost point of view. Let me say this now from our photos, that Marjorie wasn't there, she hasn't seen her face to face. And that on the off chance that Marjorie had been home, they presumably could never have been welcomed over. And as a general rule, the center moves from Steve. And Odu is better half Marjorie, who has as of late confronted charges of being the prevailing player in the Harvey family, other than possibly controlling Steve's whole image. As she would prefer, it appears, she probably won't be the faultless holy messenger. Her better half has depicted her to be to the world. These are not simple tales or unwarranted stories. Rather, they come from one of Steve's own partners, who better to let the cat out of the bag on what happens in secret than somebody firmly connected with the Harvey brand. It's a tempestuous excursion loaded up with deceptions and duplicity, Steve has fabricated his vocation on spurring individuals and offering relationship exhortation. Yet what's a relationship mentor without an accomplice for this situation? His better half, Marjorie Harvey, assumes a vital part. Steve has reliably lauded her on his show. And during honorary pathway appearances, depicting her as an astounding lady who remained close by and directed him through life's haziest minutes anyway. Late reports have disclosed an alternate side of Marjorie Harvey that Steve has kept stowed away from the world. As per the news, one of Harvey's co has Shirley Strawberry has as of late gone under examination for purportedly sharing some not exactly reciprocal considerations about her supervisor's better half Marjorie. This happened during a call with her accomplice, Ernest Williams, who is as of now detained on different charges, remembering arms ownership, burglary, and extortion. For this supposed discussion, Shirley talked about her experience as a visitor at the Harvey home and commended their rich spa and wellness offices, while additionally offering a few intriguing remarks about Steve and Marjorie's relationship, their discussion at first rotated around Marjorie's extravagantly prepared spa room. Shirley commented Marjorie has her own spa, her own exercise room. She could go in there and get rubs consistently individuals come to her home and work her out and all of that Anyway, their conversation took a fascinating transform when they dug into the subject of Marjorie's appearance. When Williams addressed whether Marjorie, the top of the Harvey family, gave off an impression of being maturing, Shirley communicated her questions, referencing that Marjorie Grape searched in pictures, yet that she hadn't seen her in person, as of late Williams appeared to be baffled and inquired as to whether Marjorie had gone to the new assembling that Shirley had been, to which she answered no. She's not there in the event that she had been there. We likely could not have possibly had the run of the house you realize I realized. I shouldn't have been in there. Yet he got us she great searches in her photos. Yet she wasn't there Shirley then. At that point, proceeded to communicate her appreciation for the chance to investigate their home as it permitted her to dream about accomplishing such a lavish way of life later in the discussion. Williams appeared to infer that it had been some time since they had hung out, and he accepted Steve was glad to see her surely seemed to affirm this maxim. He was glad to see us, he generally welcomes us over. And we never go on the grounds that I couldn't say, whether she's there you realize she views us. As something like employed assist you with realizing what will be will be her tone, propose that it's anything but a wonderful inclination, to which Williams concurred, saying, definitely you're correct. What will be will be apparently surely encounters an unpleasant energy when Marjorie is available, and this feeling appears to go neglected by Steve. This stands as a distinct difference to all that Steve has openly communicated about his better half since she came into his daily routine. Quite recently, during an experience recording of the family quarrel, the jokester imparted to the crowd the account of how they initially met their most memorable experience, 
happened in 1987 at a parody club called the Satire Zone in Memphis, where Steve was performing Marjorie, showed up later than expected to the show, and sat down at the front catching Steve's consideration with her hypnotizing excellence, quickly taking advantage of the chance he moved toward her. During his presentation, and said, excuse me, I don't have any idea what your identity is nevertheless. I will wedge you one day this account of their underlying gathering is one that Steve has regularly imparted to the world featuring what Marjorie significantly meant for his life. It presently gives the idea that even their romantic tale could have been a determined move to shape the story about Marjorie right now. This multitude of stories appear to be disentangling for Marjorie alone, as well as for the couple this episode, is only one of a progression of titles that have arisen as of late. Only a couple of days prior the Harvey name was unmistakably highlighted in the news because of reports recommending that Steve and Marjorie were experiencing relationship issues following a bamboozling embarrassment. For sure the humorous turned persuasive orator wound up in steaming hot water when reports surfaced that his better half Marjorie was purportedly having an unsanctioned romance with Steve's own guardian and individual culinary expert, William Freeman. Unexpectedly, the exciting symbol who once created a book on connections and how to satisfy a lady found the tables betrayed him because of the swindling issue. It's all in all a curve. Isn't it this story left many fans feeling thoughtful towards Steve Harvey, one individual? Communicated my heart is broken for Steve Harvey. It's not pleasant how Marjorie Harvey treated him. We don't have the foggiest idea about within story. Yet I feel that Steve is an excellent man who buckles down for his family. Anyway, the reports about Marjorie and Steve didn't stop there were additionally conversations of the couple, potentially heading out in different directions from certain sources in any event. Recommending that their relationship was in a basic stage at the time media sources, likewise detailed that Steve and Marjorie were going towards a stunner separate, esteemed at 200 million bucks. The reports got some momentum when she allegedly demanded that a questioner address her as Marjorie Scaffolds. What's her name from a past marriage? This assertion added fuel to the developing pressure between the style blogger and the entertainer Marjorie has a seriously momentous past. She had previously gone through two bombed relationships and had three kids before she turned into the holy person like figure in Steve's eyes Marjorie and Jim Townsend tied the gesture during the 1990s and had two youngsters together. Anyway, their marriage was allegedly defaced by Jim's contribution in criminal operations which at last prompted his capture and detainment. Lately, Jim Townsend stood out as truly newsworthy by, and by apparently subsequent to composing an educate all diary concerning his union. With a star during the 1990s, Jim Townsend communicated his interests about their family circumstance. He expressed in all honesty, I love mine, let me say this now, he should be called out for how she's treating this family, as per Radar Online Jim chose to share his side of the story in regards to his relationship with Marjorie, and clarified that he had no devotion to her. He uncovered I composed 66% of the book in jail. She showed her hand, I will recount my story, it doesn't make any difference assuming that she is familiar with it. Supposedly, he was careful not to make any hurried moves because of worries for their youngsters, as revealed by Radar on the web. Yet apparently, Townsend's cases had a reality to them, as Marjorie was supposedly being scrutinized by the FBI. During their marriage specialists had marked Townsend as a medication master, in spite of the fact that Marjorie was never accused of a medication-related wrongdoing. It appears to be that her relationship with Townsend brought undesirable consideration into her life. Yet, how might we accommodate the way that her subsequent spouse was likewise associated with drug managing Marjorie's subsequent marriage? Was to Darnell Woods an association that occurred in the mid-2000s little is realized about their relationship, with the exception of the way that Woods like Townsend had a set of experiences as a street pharmacist their marriage, 
notwithstanding the absence of accessible data, was moderately fleeting, while the design symbol has tried to limit any association with her past. It appears to be that it has kept on re-merging in the news over the course of the years over, and again causing to notice her set of experiences. Apparently individuals may be beginning to see the genuine Marjorie, and maybe this will provoke more data about her to arise up to that point. We'll be hanging tight for her to give a clarification to why her better half may be uneasy about her yet. What do you think about this? Do you think Marjorie has been lying about everything for such an extremely long time? Let me in on in the remarks segment beneath. And assuming you at any point need to fulfill your tattle desires, or essentially need to know what to expect from.